Okay, so I just got done with my workout and I'm like, ugh, I love, 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 love fitness. It's so therapeutic for me, especially like, because there's been a lot of changes and a lot of things going on in my life. But anyway, so the Lord was um, speaking to me while I was working out, um, which is why I love it. And like, he really talks to me and he brings up so many great points because our culture is so... Um, bombarded with so much so one thing that he really highlighted to me today was modesty and like and like really finding balance of like being a christian of being a woman of in, in god in christ and being fit and modesty and like how to balance that because that's something that i have been really seeking the lord on like even like what am i what does he want me to wear kind of thing like when i work out i don't want to um because the the bible says that we are not to cause people to fall into sin which means like provoke especially other men especially men who are married you know and to me it's like been such a really interesting thing because even when i go to the gym now um like today i worked out at home but when I go to the gym, like I get really, um, I don't like people looking at me and staring at me. And I've always, I'm just going to address the elephant in the room, but like, I've always had a really, um, like a sexy body. So people, you know, like I have the hips and I have, you know, all that. So I've just naturally always been that way. So for me, it was always very, cause I've always had the Holy spirit, you know? So I was always very uncomfortable with, like unless i was drunk then i didn't really care but like on a day-to-day -day, right so i was always really um conscious and cautious of like drawing attention to me and especially married men or anything like that so for me it was very hard to find that balance and even now it's something that i'm asking the lord on like him to guide me like how much is too much and like what he wants me to really focus because you know we're working out we're, we're sweating we're not trying to look provocative <clears throat> or like sexy you know i'm not really here for that i just really enjoy it you know i love working out and this is something that the lord has given me since i was really young you know and i'm really not just trying to be another one you know and I've always enjoyed it I have done it maybe not the right way you know now it's like a whole different level of working out and training because like now my husband helps me and he's into like bodybuilding so I'm really doing this like a newbie and but still kind of like with that in the background excuse this hanger it's driving me crazy but my husband steams his stuff anyway so as women, we have to understand that as Christian women who like to train and work out and like want to have like cultivate the best bodies that we have, we can, we have to understand that we should not focus on being sexy for other people and other men and even like to draw attention to ourselves. We have to understand that that could be what's hindering us from seeing the results that we want. Because for me, when I really wanted, I was so hyper focused on like my my outer appearance like i was always like thinking about what i would what i can eat what i can't eat and like um working out and training yet i wasn't seeing the fruits of my labor i was never still i was never seeing the fruits of my labor one was because of I, my idolatry but two also because i was in the lord revealed to me that there was a lot of generational curses so the enemy was stealing all of my labor all of my fruits all of everything that i worked hard for the enemy would try he was stealing from me and that included my workouts oh my gosh like this is so good the lord is so amazing how he reveals everything to us because he is a faithful god he's not one to want to hinder us at all like he wants us to like re to reach every limit that every expectation to break every limit in our minds and our our lives period you know so he revealed to me that the enemy has been stealing all this time, including my workouts, including all my hard work that I put forth and why I wasn't seeing results, you know, not only that, but like the word curses that you carry, you have to understand that the word curses that are placed on you by other people. And these are spirits like in the people that is what holds on to you and like 
that is a reason why you people us we are overweight it's because these word curses sit on us and so they're so heavy in our spirits that we don't even realize that like it's hindering you it hinders us it hindered me for such a long time and i broke those curses because with the blood of the lamb not anything i could do i just was obedient and i allowed my myself to be broken before the lord and he truly did a work he truly dug deep in me he truly was faithful and all i had to do was believe him and trust him and let him guide me you know and that's all he wants for us and he really wants us to understand that he wants us to be the best versions of ourselves he loves us so much and he truly cares about everything not just what we think that he would care about but he cares about everything so anyway i gotta go because this guy's waking up so i'll talk to you guys later bye